What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Clean 118s. And today we got a few things. We got the Maisto 118 488 GTB we're going to be taking a look at. And also, just came in, I got a 118 adjustable four-post lift. So we're going to be taking a look at both items. So let's get right into it. This is probably my favorite car, the 488 GTB. I think this car is detailed nicely. Let's take it over to the Clean 118 Man Cave and take a closer look at it. got the car in the man cave we got the trunk open the engine compartment doors let's start with the wheels you have the Ferrari brake calibers back there I'm not a real big fan of the wheels I uh, wish they would have came in black uh, if I'm not mistaken they have a few pieces out uh red with black wheels and even white with black wheels i might be wrong so don't quote me on that front wheel same thing um they even turn but not that much but it's cool the interior is nice you got it pretty much a few details in there um it's okay. Steering wheel, the paddle shifts. You have the little gauges down on the console. It's pretty cool for the price of this car. This car is pretty much a, I'll say it's an affordable piece. Um, you can probably pick these up at Sam's, Costco. Um, if you're here in Houston, there's a place on Harwin Drive. I believe it's called Harwin Mall. Uh, there's a little boutique in there. They have a really big selection of 118 scale die cast model cars. So if you're here in Houston, go check them out. The front is awesome. You have the little mesh grill, both sides. Headlights are really cool. They almost look real. Um, the Ferrari emblem in the front. The trunk or boot or storage compartment opens up. That's one thing I like about Maisto diecast models, especially in 118 scale, the trunk and the hood opens up. Let's see if we can fit a set of golf clubs in here. Nope, not gonna work. So if you're planning on buying a real one and you're a golfer, you're gonna have to come up with something else, buddy. Back of the car is also pretty cool. You have the 488 GTB license tag. You have the Ferrari logo. Um, the tail lights look realistic. Exhaust tips. Uh, I like on the tail lights how they have the little clear for the reverse lights. Let's get a closer look at the badging. Yeah, that's awesome, guys. 
now the engine compartment i think mesto did an awesome job on the engine it's detailed to the fullest you can almost see the carbon fiber that they have on the inside um you can basically look straight down almost to the ground everything you have pipes and hoses and all kind of stuff just going everywhere in there i think that's pretty cool they did a great job on the motor guys um it's pretty much a flat piece uh they didn't really get into too much detail but it's still an awesome piece, guys. I love Ferraris, uh, especially the 488 GTB. Okay, so now we're going to break into this green light 118 adjustable four post lift and see what this thing looks like. Okay, this pack is really nice. Uh, we have some directions here. To put this thing together. Wow. Okay, this is pretty big. Oh, and it's metal, guys. It's die cast metal. I was wondering if this thing was going to be able to hold up with some of these heavy cars. Like in my first episode, the uh, Resin Demon. That was a really heavy car. Try not to scratch up the floor. Get all the pieces. This is awesome. really sure what these are but I'm pretty sure we're going to find out the post and here you have the little grooves so I guess you can click 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 adjust the height of it Check this one out. It has the controls and everything on it. Little motor. This is cool. Okay, let's put this thing together. Basically, guys, it's a really quick install or setup. You basically take this little lever and you pull it back and you set the post right in there and the lowest set point you can have it is where it locks into place and there you have it it's the green light Oh, I got it adjusted wrong. Let's set this one all the way to the bottom. Let it lock in place. So that way, if you have a car down at the bottom, it won't fall and damage your car. Got the little ramps. And these are just like extra little lifts you can put inside like this. And you squeeze these to just basically set it in place. Um, we're not going to put those on there just yet. But I'm going to put this four post lift where I wanted it. Okay, guys. We have the lift in place. This is where I wanted it. Um, it's going to stay there and... In my future episodes, you're going to see some cool cars on it. Let's take a closer look.
stay tuned for the next episode of Clean 118s. We're going to be taking a look at this new Ray Wildlife Hunter Jeep. I believe it's 118 scale. It looks 118, so we're going to take a look at it. And guess what? It has suspension. All right, guys, that's it. Thanks for tuning in. Don't forget, hit that like and subscribe button. I'm out. Peace.